Hello, here is a quick tip. If you, uh, like me, have occasionally imported data with somebody's name wrong, or the track names are different, uh, or there's variables in the session that you wanted to be able to capture, uh, but you forgot to put them in the notes. One of the things that uh, some people don't know is you can click on a session, and you can see here that I've got this listed as James' wrong name. Uh, it's at uh, Oregon, and I wanted to say Oregon Raceway Park, uh, and there's probably additional information I want to change. Now there's two ways you can do this. I find the easiest is you right click on that and click on test properties. The box will pop up and you can add additional information or change what's there. So here I can go in and I can say, oh, that actually should be uh, James Coben, my name, and the track was actually Oregon Raceway Park. So I can click on there. I could add any additional sessions here, but if I click on OK, now you can see that that data has changed. It's under the right name uh, and it's at the right track in terms of the information that's there. There is a second way you can do this as well which is if you don't want to right click, you can also go up to data here and on test properties and the same situation applies and it pops up. And so hopefully that is a very useful tip should you be like me and you have lots of data and you want to make sure there's continuity so that for example, your filter process works or you put the right driver against the right session, the right track, the right test type, the right championship. So there you go, hope that's useful.